Hey guys, Run With Craft Scissors here with another plan with me. So we're doing the week of November 16th through the 22nd. We're in my happy planner and we're using a sub kit that was gifted to me from my friend Laura. So thank you, Laura. Um, it's from Sweet Kawaii Design. It's the Lumberjack Kawaii sub kit. Um, so there's lots and lots of pages um, for me to choose from. But I was super excited to do this one because I just launched the Buffalo plaid and the black and white um, checked plaid. Um, this one's the small version of the bow. I do have the larger one as well if you want to see the difference. So I do have those available. And then this one just came out. And then this week I did the Buffalo plaid budget clips of these three. So those go up tonight at 8 p.m. at Central Standard Time. So that's part of new releases. And then this is this week's freebie. So I was like, ah, oh, it's like I planned it. <laughs> All right. And then I have my acorn clip. There's some acorn checklists. I thought I might use those. Um, and then she does use... Her sloth, that's not it, that's the woodchuck, but there is a sloth in some of these somewhere. Simon's in here. Um, and then I did grab the toasted marshmallow because there is a s'more. It's not like a very big one. And so I went ahead and also grabbed the campfire one because there's a lot of like in the woods kind of feel. Um, so I'm calling it wild and free because I plan on using that one as my theme sticker. Oh yeah, and then I have cocoa um, palm here because of all the brown. So I pulled that in as well. And then I have my November word clip because... We're in the month of November, and then I have my black and white pen loop as well. Yay. Okay, so let's move everything out of the way. I did go ahead and do the date covers. I didn't want to spend too much time doing that and whiting out and all that kind of thing. Just kind of things a little bit of time, honestly. Okay, so where's my other two? They're over here. There's the little coffee mug. All right, so bottom washi. I have to decide. So I think I'm going to go with the black and white checked bottom washi i think i'm gonna go ahead and put that down now. not so i don't like change my mind <laughs> but because i want to make sure everything flows together this time around so i am going to go ahead and go all the way across with it so i'm not going to trim it down i don't think i need to if i'm doing it this way okay maybe a little bit like a sliver i might have to shave it off but i think we'll be okay now this one i will have to trim down because it'll overhang way 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 too much okay way too much so sweet Kawhi just came out with some new releases that are adorable and then um in the sweet Kawhi facebook group i was just looking at it before i started filming and someone posted i guess there was at some point i think it's a simon and he's like rolling his eyes. <laughs> and the person who posted it said something about like, if you have a teenager, you definitely need this sticker. Um, how about making a whole sheet of this? So I hope Tasia does. Because <laughs> that would be awesome. The eye rolling one. <laughs> I definitely would use some of that. I have had some eye rolling moments lately. For sure. Okay. So that looks good there. Would it be weird if I start building up to the top? That'd be weird. Totally not like me. Okay, so we did our bottom washi. There's three more because it's supposed to be four weeks of planning. And I have done that challenge. I actually did that. That's how I started my year. So I don't know if you saw that one. But I definitely did that. All right, so there's some cute stickers here that we're going to be using. There is some header stickers that are not labeled. They're kind of like deco. And then there's freestanding checklist here. I don't think that there's full box checklist there's some more headers there they're half boxes yeah so it's all freestanding checklists that's exciting all right I think I'm going to stick with this one but I might fill it in with some of these wood green ones because I don't really want to have open boxes every day so ass okay so we're going to go ahead and use headers I guess I'll use up the ones on here so I guess we mix and match I guess that's what we're supposed to do I think that she includes like at least enough steam stickers to um four weeks. So I think they vary a little bit on how much she does like the open boxes or closed boxes. So it kind of depends on your style. But a box from my friend Julia. So thank you for sending that to me. It was perfect timing too. I did go ahead and film what you sent me. So thank you. That will be up later this week. So 
excited to show that. And then I keep meaning to message Kristen because she had commented that I needed to check my mailbox, I think, last Saturday. And I definitely did, and there wasn't anything. And then I went this last Saturday, and there wasn't anything either. So I hope it didn't get lost, whatever it was. Maybe it's there now. Um, but I pretty much only am able to go check my P.O. box on Saturdays because I do pick up after school for my kiddo, and my P.O. box is nowhere near that so it'll take at least another 30 minutes we have a lot of traffic on <laughs> not a lot of traffic we have a lot of traffic lights okay <laughs> you have that problem where you live <laughs> like uh growing up in california we had actual traffic but here i feel like it's just a bunch of traffic lights getting in there my son and i actually have a thing where we like count the traffic lights from like his school to home and see how many green ones we can get. <laughs> Weird little card games, I guess. I need to update his playlist on Spotify, too. Because there's a couple of songs on there that he always says skip. But then, like, I'm like, do you want these on your playlist? And he's like, yeah. I'm like, no, you don't. You say skip every time. So why are we playing this game <laughs> of keeping them on here for me to hit next? <laughs> we don't always listen to his music, but... Usually, sometimes I throw in a few. I'm like, I like this one. For some reason, he doesn't remember watching Shrek. Um, I had I'm a Believer on his playlist, and I was like, you know, you remember from Shrek. And he was like, what are you talking about? And I was like, oh, no. So he forgot. All right, so Wild and Free is going to be our theme sticker. I'm going to go ahead and stick that down now. I'm, like, planning all over the place, aren't I? I'm still trying to decide how I want my spread to look. Um, I think you guys enjoyed for the most part. I got um, a few comments already on yesterday's plan with me because I did do a um, Sweet Kawhi inspired layout in my Erin Condren. I don't plan on doing that in this one necessarily. I could, but I wasn't going to. It was another sub kit though that she used. I might do that with the whole weekend banner. That could be fun. All right, so let's do the freestanding checklist. I think I am going to go ahead and do the acorn and tree, giant tree stump because it's kind of high. Okay, so I will have room for washi. And I have lots of choices. I do have a maroon. It's like a solid maroon, simply gilded, that I felt like matched. Color it the people do. A little hearts, like. Like people would carve into a tree kind of thing. I don't know. It just does. So, <laughs> you know those memes where it's like it's winter in the morning and then by the afternoon you're like sweating? We usually have that weather right about now, but lately it's been like kind of warm in the afternoon and then we're back to like freezing cold the evening we're not supposed to hit we're not supposed to go above 70 degrees at least for the next 10 days so hence the little hoodie sleeves that you're seeing in this video <laughs> i'm like and we're back to chilly days these acorns are so cute so that's why i had to grab my acorn clip i was like it matches yeah had to do it had to do it. love my acorn clip she even has little, I don't know if you guys can see it, but it has cut lines on the top to make the little crisscrosses. Top of it. Acorn shell, that's what I'm going to call it, I think. <laughs> it was funny, I was looking up when I was doing the Christmas sleigh listing. I was like, what's the bottom part of the sleigh called? <laughs> I still don't remember what it's called now. I But I was like trying to make it so that you guys would, um, that would be the drop down box for picking whether you want a gold or silver, like, um, I already forgot the part. Glider part? I don't know. Made that up. So I do have this plaid, which I was kind of going with that one, the buffalo plaid. But I'm like, I'm traditional buffalo plaid here and there. I feel like this is traditional buffalo plaid. And then I have the crisscrossy one, which I think came from Target a long time ago. That one was Hobby Lobby recently. And then these were de-sashed to me from, um... Cupcakes and stickies from Mary. 
So this one has like black and green and red. So I'm not going to do that one. That's a definite no. And then I have this skinny one that Julia just sent me. And I, she also sent me a wider one too. But I felt like it was really similar to this width. And then I have this maroon color that I felt like matched, this, matched that maroon. And then I had this plaid as well with the gold bows on it. Um, these, this one and this one I think are from Jennifer. And then I had this one. Not sure who that one's from, but I like the wood grain. And so I was like, maybe I'll use that. I don't know. This one's pretty wide though. So we'll see about that one. Cause I only put wide washi at the bottom in there. Okay. So I think I'm going to use at least for this part. I'm going to use this one. No, I'm going to use this one. I'm going to use the traditional. Get it off because I think I want to use that skin. I don't know. I might use the traditional buffalo plaid at the top. I haven't picked out my top washi yet. I've had this for a while. Like I said, I need a range. Um, stash of washi samples and such so that I know what I have and use up what I have. Sure. Well, I don't know. I don't think I've ever shown you guys this one. I don't think I've ever used this one. I did have a buffalo kit, I think, from Party Planner. Like a mini kit or something. I think she did it as like a bonus in a sale. I feel like that's what I'm remembering. I'm trying to get that straight, but it's kind of hard to tell <laughs> if I am. Because those aren't perfectly lined up because they're, they're different shapes. It's kind of hard to tell. All right, so I did a wider one there. We'll kind of have to see up. All right, so then we have some full boxes. Not those, because those are kind of like thicker. I definitely want that for later. We will use that. <laughs> okay, so I think I'm going to go with the characters. There's another one that has like wild animals on it, which is also pretty cool. See, there's the traditional. She didn't pick that one to use for the headers, I guess. I don't see that on any of these. Okay, so I'm going to use this one. That one up. And then I think I'm going to grab the Weekend Banner and then Deco or something over here. Kind of what I'm planning. Oh, yeah, look, there's even a little pumpkin spice candle. Yeah, see, there's my s'more. There is a little flame, but I think that's for the build due of like paint for that. Okay. Let's go ahead and put those down but like I said we're gonna do like a weekend banner kind of deco over here so let me go ahead and lay that down because that's what she did in her plan with me like I said I'm not doing another mock-up but I kind of liked how that worked out so I'm gonna put that there knowing that there's gonna be a or something okay so let's see I think we're just gonna go across and kind of see where we end up but I do want to make sure I use this. So I think I'm actually going to start backwards. It. Tweezers and this kind of sticker in this size. Not. Go down. I could do headers again. But it's the same pattern and I already put washi tape on them. So I wasn't going to. Alright, here's Simon. Got his little beanie on. Little fuzzy coat. There has been mornings where I've had to grab my coat. Today was rainy. It was pretty rainy this afternoon. Okay. Now her stickers are um, removable and movable. So I like that a lot. Okay, we're going to grab this wood grain mousse. And there's a buffalo. That's cute. Buffalo plaid. I'm mixing plaids. There was no way I was going to not be able to mix plaids. So we're just going to have to own that one. Oh, I did want to use this one. Maybe I'll use it in the sidebar. I'll use it in the sidebar. That'll be like my grocery list or something. We have some Monday through Sunday. But the other stuff is freestanding for those. So that's what we use in the sidebar for grocery. It will be fine. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and grab this. Because I'm
the header and then have the we'll pull in we'll do the red I'm not doing a super brown spread like I said I might okay and then we need another header I want the same what plaid is that? Oh, it's messy. Okay. Fine. I like it for the skinny. It makes it easy. For sure it does. So I messed up dinner. <laughs> not really. I made the recipe, but the recipe was not very good. So I sometimes I try to do keto recipes because then I know that like my husband can eat and not have a reaction, but the problem is they're high in fat, and I don't have a gallbladder, so I'm not really supposed to eat that stuff because it doesn't make me feel good. So, <laughs> so my son really liked it. Plus, I use sweet salsa. Let me explain. So it was a taco casserole, taco keto casserole is what it was called, and um, I thought I was like, you know, a professional chef or something, and thought I could do this. No, I can't. So I do have the maroon, but I feel like I didn't pull in enough of the maroon to justify using that. So I'm not gonna. Um, but I am thinking brainstorm. Where's that other washi? Did I already lose it? Where's the other one that's black and white? Check. There it is. Okay, so I was thinking. Oh, I can't stack this one and this one together. Okay, so I'm thinking this one is going to have to go up here. Yeah, we might have to. because We'll do that one up there. So this one needs to be down here probably. Which means we do need to have... I don't want to do a combo of plaids. So we will do white out. Covering it, but we'll see. So we'll do kind of a mock up on this side. I'm using the washi tape from Julia. Dashed a bunch of spare sneeze. So I needed to use it because I love it. All the plaid. And then. I had not seen a skinny one like this one before. Um, hopefully, Julia, you're watching this and you can comment below and say where you got this from in case other people want it. Because that's what we all are going to want. Okay. So I'm going to put down headers again. But I'm going to start the row over so that it matches the top one. I'm going to go with this one. This will be like my extra washi section. Right, an extra washi. My extra header section. I think it's because it's patterned. Oh. You just jumped right off. Did you see that? Put it messy. And then next one doesn't really matter what row, honestly. It did it because it's that maroon. You have to be careful. But like little pokey. And when I pull on it too hard with the tears, if I pinch too hard. I got to be careful. Okay, so it is not. I don't do camping. <laughs> um, I have before when I was younger. Um, I wouldn't say when we had the RV. My parents rented an RV once for this festival thing. Oh, I need to put white washi tape. Okay, I don't think I need the white out. I think we're okay. But some of it, sometimes it peeks through in between. The header, so I think I'm gonna go ahead and do it anyway. I changed my mind. Anyway, oh, start talking. Oh, you can still. Okay. All right, so then we're gonna put this back. Okay, this one might look a little. Other checked. Oh, why am I putting this down first? Somebody yell. Who yelled? Thank you. So the bottom is the darker. Now this will be kind of difficult to get straight since I didn't put full boxes all the way across. 
But I will try. Cool skinny. I don't know if I plan on either. plaid spread or not. Because some Christmas kits have this kind of pattern as well. But I thought this would be a good one to kind of transition from fall to winter. I do have, I have the kit from I'm a Stick Radix that's like super foiled, the uh, fall one. That's the one I plan on using for Thanksgiving in this planner in case you're like, I've never seen you use it. But Sassy Stephanie, she filmed a couple, a couple or at least one that I've seen um, of the super foiled kits from I'm a Sticker Addict. And so I did watch some of those. I've been watching a lot of planners. Sometimes I don't always listen. I've talked about this before, but sometimes I, do, <laughs> I get really listen. So I'm like filling orders and I want to stay focused or like my kid is around and so I want to like pay attention to him but I do kind of like having a background of like something going on so I will do that and then the morning is when I usually watch my insta stories I just let my phone play while I'm getting ready I glance down and watch so gotta give people those views and I do like reacting to people's insta stories do you guys do that I have a couple of you that do and I always just go thanks so like you know I saw that you reacted I don't ignore it <laughs> Sometimes it starts a whole conversation with people. Like, you can build a quick friend, I feel like, when you do things like that. Okay, so there is adventure and some deco stickers here. And then there's some deco stickers here. I kind of want to do the marshmallow one as well. And then there's, like, a comfy. There's a cocoa over here, too. So there's, like, a whole thing. Okay, so I think I'm going to put... I like the tree stump because I went with the tree stump page there. I don't think I'm going to use the word. I'll put this one here. Put everywhere. I don't know the name of the buffalo or the woodchuck. But there's Simon. There's going to be like floating around. <laughs> Just decorating. And then more here. I have a whole sheet of this more stuff, so. I feel like I need one more over here, but I don't know what. I should do a fluffy pillow for sleeping in or something. There's also this cute little flag here. I already have all this. Okay, we'll do the crisscross arrow. I get it. Grab that. There. I think that looks good. Okay, so then usually I do half boxes. And then possibly quarter boxes. There's some half boxes on this one. The quarter box. There's also some important ones. There's more deco on here too. Oh, there's like bear with me. Oh, there's a pun. Love it. That. There's a don't forget. Okay, all those I don't need. There's the half box. There they are. I found them. Those right now. Oop, just a paper clip somewhere. There it is. Okay, so we have these ones. I kind of like the solid ones because we went so crazy with our patterned washi that I'm kind of feeling the solid one. Maybe I should do like every other, like a solid pattern, solid pattern. Cool. Okay, hope so. Hope that's good. Once again, bigger box. Oh, that's funny. The little washi strip at the top matches it. I did not plan. But I'll grab a pattern one and a washi. But I was like, oh, we'll use up these first. I like to see if I can use up sheets. Well, sometimes I like that. It kind of looks like it's taped to the header. Fun. The green one here. So not pattern blocking whatsoever. I just matched my headers. That's all I've really done. Do anything. Here's that maroon color. I'm not sure I'm going to put any more washi in between this and the quarter box. I might just leave some white. I don't like her, actually. Okay, so there's more wood grain or there's plaid. I think I'm going to grab the plaid. Grab the black and white checked one. 
I know, shocker. I feel like it's not white, white, though. It's almost like a cream. It's like a cream to me. Okay. So I didn't grab the red, red. I haven't done that one yet, so I think we'll grab that. For this last one. Do that one there. And then quarter boxes are on the same sheet as the weekend banner and the habit tracker. I love that little maple leaf. Don't you, Becky and Elizabeth, my Canadian friends, and Miranda. I was trying to remember. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. I know another one. <laughs> okay, so I have... Do I need to go like this? Do I need to snake it? So that... Or do I... Yeah, I'm going to like snake it. A little funny. Okay, so I think I'm just going to leave some space. I'm going to leave some white space. Can you believe it? I know. Who's this? What? Okay. So I use these not the week we're currently in, but the week before. And I mostly wrote down what I ate for lunch. <laughs> or what we ate for lunch. I don't know why. I just thought it would be fun to put that in there. Um, I do feel like sometimes it's like, what else can I use my planner for? Or um, since we're not really doing anything else that day, I can write down what we had for lunch. I don't know. Just to kind of like use your planner. I'm going straight across. But I think this will also give room for icons. If I want to put an icon sticker, then it's not going to overlap another one. But I think that's kind of nice as well. But I wasn't trying to make things perfectly straight. Because honestly, these boxes, I think, go up a little bit higher than the other ones. So that would have potentially caused some problems in trying to use washi tape there anyhow. Okay, so there's some quarter boxes. Then we need to washi -fy the top part. I think I'm going to go with the plaid again just because I just, I put that buffalo one there. I don't really, I could do the crisscrossy buffalo plaid or the one with no bow. But, and then that one's kind of pink, so I wasn't going to pick that. I'm going to go with this one. I kind of want to use it too. But yeah, definitely love this one. And I'm like, I should have had this when I did the I'm a sticker addict one. But I totally forgot I even had this. That's what I was like. Definitely need to rearrange. So I said I was going to use the wider one and then I pulled off the skinny. It's fine. No big deal. I do like that I ended up matching my gold foiling. Sometimes when I use the bow washi from Simply Gilded, I'm like, oh, this is the perfect color or perfect pattern. But then the foiling is not the same. And then I feel like, am I supposed to use it? I mean, it's my planner, so I get to decide, but <laughs> I don't want it to look terrible either or bug me later that it's like, oh, this one's gold and this one's silver. This one's gold and this one's rose gold. I feel like the gold and rose gold is not as bad, but I don't know. Are you a purist and you're boiling on your spreads? I would love to know. Does this count as a white space spread since I have freestanding checklist and I created space down here? Does it count? <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> I'm probably still no white space. It's fine. Okay, so remember how I said that I had like extra header stuff? And I was like, oh, I could use this as washi. And then I called it washi. So I'm going to grab those. And I think I'm going to stick them. I'm going to stick them between the habit trackers, possibly. I don't know. It's just me. Not real solid on it just yet, but that'll be fun. Okay, so I'm just going to grab the first three. I'm not going to be super picky about this nonsense. Mm -mm. Not. Okay, so you might see this again in January because I feel like it's kind of a wintry. It's kind of fall, but it's kind of wintry. So I think I might use this kit again in January. Is that cool? Hope so because I'm probably doing that. I don't know. I, really, I just really like it. <laughs> but it'll be with the wild animals. Which is funny because I actually. Okay, so I'm going to stack these ones on top of each other though. And then. I usually like to have three. So I think I'm going to go ahead and do all three. Even though it's going to hang over. I think I'm okay with that. This one has the brown. But I kind of want to incorporate more of the brown. I use that brown half box and quarter box. Oh, those match. I did not mean to do that. Oh, well. <laughs> It happens. There's leftovers. Leftovers there, too. Okay. 
Now, there was a sheet that had cute little scripty functional thingies on it. There it is. <laughs> I was like, there was a sheet that did that. Not that one, just this one, I think. Yeah. Okay, so whenever I use this kit in my Aaron Condor, I'm always like, can't use that. That doesn't apply to this planner and that kind of thing. So I'm like, ugh. Now I finally can. So here's the to buy. Put that on this little plaid header. And then I don't think there's a dinner sticker. Is there a meal sticker? I love that there's scissors. I'm not seeing a meal one. I'm seeing a cleaning one. Payday sticker. So Etsy pays on Tuesday, so we can put that down. Oops, why? I don't, I don't know if I'm going to grab script to do. There's three of them, but not a ton. Um, no days off. There is set up planner. That's cute. Is there just a planner? Is, there on a, is it on another sheet? I don't know. Okay, we'll use set up planner. So that's like my plan with me. So I do that on Mondays. In here. And then... I definitely go to the mail on Saturday, every Saturday. We'll put this little envelope with the heart on Saturday. So cute. And then there's appointment, clean, our computer. We could use this one for the work from home sticker. That one, that there. And then Laundry, not super planned out when that happens. Or is Gorkery. I just kind of use it as a go on those ones. Lazy day. That should be on Sunday. But we'll see. That there. Cute. Okay. I don't think there's any like set things I need to like call for or do any of that necessarily ahead of time. So I think I'll leave that as is and grab my stickers that I want to use okay so virtual learning for my kiddo is on Wednesday still for now virtual learning and then seated learning kind of using these up now because doing seated learning on Monday Tuesday Thursday Friday so it's not that hard to remember or anything like that more of like I have these so I'm using them <laughs> I bought these custom ones from Ilza she still sells on Instagram but she has officially closed her Etsy shop so there's that you're trying to find them okay and then vitamins goes in a habit tracker this is from temp loves crafts you guys can check them out on Etsy as well I think they have a standalone shop Trying to remember. I'm not sure. Okay, I have meetings every Tuesday. It varies on who it's with, but there's always a meeting on Tuesday. I have like three groups that we're part of. There's always meetings. This is from Templates Crafts as well. And then brush the teeth, habit tracker sticker. I ripped that one last week. I don't want to talk about it. From Washi Wife Mama Life. Jean Day stickers. So we have Jean Days on Tuesdays and Fridays for now. Put it on there. It's fine. These are from Raindrops on Paper Co. And the little heart is like a denim heart. Not before. I love it. Alright, and then we have our coffee sticker. Yeah, there wasn't a coffee sticker. Oh, yeah, there is. Oh, we'll wait. This one. That first coffee. I'm going to put this one. All right, and then uh, we should have a trash day sticker. Not seeing a trash can at all. No. Okay, so we have this trash day, or there should be another trash day sticker that's like a script sticker. So we'll see about that. I'll see. Okay, and then I do pick up every day. I feel like this is drop off. I do pick up. I don't think it really matters. But. So that one is Monday. 
These are from my friend Laura. I think she got them in a grab bag. Friday. Now, if they switch the hours, then I won't be able to pick them up anymore. I know. So sad. And they don't switch it. Okay, I should have work from home. Trip sticker. Sarah Elizabeth Prince. So, I don't know why I laid this down. I knew I was going to have to pick it back up after I laid it down. So, I lay this on the header, I guess. Yeah. Laptop back. What I work on. Then we have our character sticker, which totally fits our spread. I think I'm going to go the deer. That would be cool. So that's from Lisa Lorene Plans. She's on Etsy as well. All right, I don't think that anything else in particular. I was looking for that track. Oh, there's dinners. Did that sticker. And then there's reading for one ha the other habit tracker. And then his specials, I still haven't gotten like a set schedule. So I've just been asking him every day and then hoping that I remember later to write it down. <laughs> There's my trash day sticker. I knew I had one. There's my script sticker from Templates Grass that says trash day. I put that on Wednesday. Well, put the trash out on Wednesday, but it gets picked up on Thursday. Okay, then I have glasses from I'm a sticker art. Pop up at all. I need to pop up and then go. I feel like sometimes I can feel it. Feel it to see stickers. Whisper. That one is not. There it goes. I'll do this one. That's the one I could get up. That's reading. Which I don't know why I did the reading tonight. I definitely did the reading tonight and I was like, I did have someone here that I could do. Last time. Getting a bit frustrating. Sarah Elizabeth Prince as well. All right, and then I don't think I'm going to put down weather just yet. It's really been changing a lot lately, you guys, so I want to just... Put that in as it comes, I think. At least while our weather is currently in like the I'm gonna change every ten So we'll just wait on that. So I'm not gonna go here and show everything that's left over, but just know yes, I have enough to do at least another at least one more week of no white space and then it gets a little bit more difficult because I run out of full boxes. But that's just because of the bad plan. So I'm sure it's fine. <laughs> All right, so we're going to have the Buffalo Plaid Art from the Budget Clip set. I definitely want to have the little mug as well. And then I want to have the new Cocoa Palm. I hope you guys get to snag one of those. And then definitely want the acorn because I have acorns in the spread. And then there was another one I want to make sure. Where's the mushroom? Did I lose my mushroom? Mushroom. Marshmallow. I also can't talk. Apparently. There you go. Mushroom. <laughs> Hope I gave you guys a little laugh about that one. All right, then I want this one. Yeah, so then we'll put the little one. I put the little one over here. Okay, we're gonna have to move some things. Okay, here. Okay. Okay, so I did not have room for the sloth or my bear. Or the other buffalo plaid bow. Where's the freebie bow? There it is. I also had the freebie from too. Did not have room for all of them, but I love them all. And then I have my black and white checked pen loop here to go in my planner to make everything match and look super fabulous. So I hope you guys enjoyed this plan with me. Make sure you give this video a like. I do have one of those referral codes that gets me like points when you do sweet kawaii design. 
that'll be in the description box below as well. And new releases from iShop go up tonight at 8 p.m. Central Standard Time. And the link in the description box gives you the code YouTube10 automatically applying to your cart. So I hope you guys enjoy that. And I will see you guys in my next plan with me. Make sure you are subscribed. Bye, guys.